Hey everyone, it's Sarah and I am here with my sixth layout using the January Hip Kit. And this one is going to be about my favorite herbal tea and it's a holiday tea. I love that tea. I literally will hoard it. <laughs> I will buy like four or five boxes when they go on sale during the holidays and I drink them all the time. I'm drinking some at the, well not right the second, but um, at night I will make tea for myself. Um, and right now I'm going through a box of the Candy Cane Lane. So um, I am going to be doing a whole bunch of layering on here. And I'm going through my little packets of um, papers that I'm trying to get through this month. And I'm just going to, I'm going to pick a few here. Um, I really like that floral. I decided to not do the hearts because um, they were pink and there's no pink in that um, packaging. So it, it was a little off for me. So I decided to stick with the red instead. And um, I picked a red polka dot and a blue or a floral that has um, some blue and yellow and red in it. So that's what I'm going to go with. And I'm going to layer it with this Dear Lizzie navy floral paper and also some teal cardstock. And I'm going through my flare because I have some of these flare buttons that were made by Tony from Designs and I bought those on Etsy and I will include a link to her shop. Uh, she has a great Etsy shop for flare buttons um, and those were from a tea lovers set so they're all tea related. I'm going to use the two white ones on here. I went ahead and pulled them all out just to see if there's any you know just to give myself the options but I'm going to do the two white ones and um, I pulled out those Enamel dots, those are from my mind's eye, those are from my stash sitting on my desk, so I'm going to use up all those. And um, I'm just kind of looking around my desk to see what I can add on here. Um, this is a border strip from one of the Amy Tangerine papers that came in the kit, and I'm just going to kind of layer that under there to add a little bit more interest. And now I'm looking at my tray um, of die cuts from the kit. And I'm going to pull out a few flowers. Um, the one on, that I put on top there says, Honestly, I love you. Um, I'm going to use that banner to hold my title. I'm just trying to see. Uh, that one says, Everyday Awesome. And um, I'm just looking to see what I can put on here. Uh, let's see. I think I'm just kind of putting things where I'm pretty positive I want them to go and I'm going to start um, sticking stuff down here in a second. So the only things that didn't come in the January kit are the cardstock, which came in the December kit, um, the two scraps of pattern paper, the two 6x6 six six papers, and the enamel dots and the flare. So everything else did. Um, a lot of Heidi Swap die cuts because a lot came in those packages, man. I'm not going to be able to use up those packages. There's no way. <laughs> There's way too much in there. Um, I guess that's kind of a good problem to have. At least I wasn't running out of things, but man, just a lot. I mean, that package had 104 pieces in it, so. But I'm not putting a lot of pressure on myself, you know, to use up absolutely everything. So it's all good. So I'm going to go ahead and get all this put down and I'm keeping everything kind of centered because that background paper, um, it's hard to kind of see, it's hard for me to see right now, I don't know if it's hard for you to see, but um, that background paper is a craft and it's from Amy Tangerine and it says hello love repeatedly on it and it looks like it's stitched. Um, it looks really cool. So I wanted that to you know be prominent, I didn't want to cover up all of that um, and I like that it's it's craft with white pattern, so it's not like in your face, but it's there. Um, okay, so I got all my stuff stuck down, and I'm going to do my title using these small Dear Lizzie letter tile stickers. And I'm the title's going to be Cuppa, for like cup of tea, and they were a little bit too thick to fit on that banner, so I'm just cutting I'm just cutting them down a little bit. There's plenty of room to you know cut off a little bit from the sides and make it all fit. So that's what I'm doing here. And then I'm going to use my quick dry adhesive to put those down because they do not stick very well at all. 
Sorry, it's shining off my light. They're like a gold foil, so <laughs> they're very shiny. But you'll see it a lot better in the close-ups. I'm also going to use some of the the word stickers on here. I'm going to use two on the top and two on the bottom. Um, that one says enjoy and that one says hello. I'm going to use those two together on the top here. And I'm going to do two on the bottom as well. I'm just kind of reading through them to see which ones I want to use. Uh, that one says golden. And I also use happy. I'm going to go ahead and put my enamel dots down here. I'm using that entire row and that finishes up that package that I've had on my desk for a while. Love being able to throw away a package of stuff. Sorry, an empty package of stuff. <laughs> you don't want to throw away a full package of stuff. An empty package of stuff. And I'm kind of looking and seeing what else I want to do. And I realized, I thought it would be kind of cool to highlight some of the text in the background paper. So I'm going to go get a navy blue Sharpie, a very thin one. And I'm going to go over two spots and make... Um, just testing to make sure it looks navy. <laughs> um, I'm going to go over some of the text here in two different places. So it's going to say, hello, love, and it'll stand out pretty boldly there. And I actually really like the way that it comes out. I'm literally just going over um, the text there. And I have to do it twice just to make sure it it stands out. The Sharpie was kind of seeping into the paper a little bit, so I wanted to make sure it was bold. I like that one little added element I have there. And I don't do any journaling on this um, layout because, I mean, it's pretty obvious that I love that tea, so <laughs> I don't really feel like I need to, uh, to uh, repeat it. In journaling so and that's it guys that completes my layout I hope you enjoyed it if you guys have any questions at all let me know and I will see you again real soon have a great day guys bye